This is a video to show how to enable the watchdog feature on your slimmed in receiver. The watchdog feature is used so a transmitter and a receiver can display the maintaining of a pairing with one another when the transmitter transmits a signal to the receiver. As long as the receiver receives that signal on a regular basis, it will hold the Relay 4 energised at all times on your slimmed in receiver. So if there's a problem and the radio signal is not received, thus indicating a fault, the watchdog drops out. So on the slimmed in receiver, we use Relay 4, which is our watchdog relay, and the time delay the slimmed in receiver allows is set by the time delay, which is controlled in menu 2, for the watchdog in menu 4. So the time delay in menu 2 is a down counting system, so say if my watchdog is set to 10 seconds for example, what will happen is, each time a watchdog radio signal is received from a transmitter, it will reset that down counter back to 10 again. It will count down in seconds, and if the receiver fails to receive a watchdog transmission signal in the specific time you've set, so 10 seconds let's say, the receiver will drop out of pairing mode with the transmitter. So we recommend you have the receiver's time delay set to at least three times the watchdog transmit interval set on your transmitter. Okay, so enough explaining. First, we set up the receiver to enable the watchdog watchdog feature. So first we go into menu 4. We do this by holding the M button for 2 seconds. Wait for the LED to flash, then press again and cycle through to menu 4 by repressing your M button. Once hovering on menu 4, press your L button and you've now selected menu 4. So now we have the option of toggling the watchdog to on or off by repressing our M button. Ensure you leave this LED on, press your L button to confirm, your four LEDs will flash, and the watchdog is enabled. So now, when I operate a button on my paired transmitter, LED 4 will ignite for as long as it receives a signal. For more information on our slim dim receiver, check out our other videos on our YouTube channel, or alternatively, check the product datasheet.